killing her grandson while driving drunk last weekend was indicted by a grand jury today. Gina Mitchell is charged with two counts of aggravated vehicular homicide and one count of unauthorized use of a motor vehicle. Nine on your side's Jason Law is in Mount Airy where family members are remembering young Logan tonight. Jason? And Clyde, they're doing it. Logan's family is doing it by holding a balloon release coming up in a little less than an hour. They're going to release balloons here at the Mount Airy Forest Park coming up at 7 o'clock. Take a look at a video from the accident six days ago. This was Saturday night, and this was on the Clay Wade Bailey Bridge. Police say Gianna Mitchell was drunk when she drove her nine year old daughter and four year old grandson. Investigators told us Mitchell hit another car and flipped over, and that killed Logan. Tonight, again, the family is gathering to try and start the healing process. And I talked with Gianna's sister, LaToya, about what this has done to her family. It's destroyed. I've lost my sister and I've lost my grandbaby. It's, I mean, no one is really willing to, to stand with her at this time. And, I mean, I, I know it's, got, it's, it's going to be a healing process, but right now it's a lot of bitterness going on. Now, investigators say Logan was wearing a seatbelt, but he was not in a car seat, which is required by law. His grandmother faces up to 11 years in prison. We're live tonight. Jason Law, not on your side. All right, Jason, thanks for that report.